ang kwetyo. Ang nung yung mga kahaman to, kaya yung mga nito yung isa mga kaya. Hay chi kay to ni ông yu ra tom ro bi ta chu tu krom mai ta bi ka pi kdai luk yeng seri da bai mi nok kah tang tom lu ding dao chim pu sa sai ro cham ton som chuin good afternoon mr president good afternoon your honor and good afternoon to everyone in and around the courtroom and good afternoon witness Unless there are any objections, I will refer to you as Chiam. Uh, sir, first, I want to make sure that uh, we clear up a couple of matters. One, uh, you gave two statements to the office of the co-investigative judges, one on 5 December 2007 and the second one on 21st September 2008. Is that right? All right, maybe there's a mistranslation. One is 2007, and the second one is 2008. And at the conclusion of giving those statements, you were read out a summary, and uh, you signed them, or you put your thumb to it, thumbprint to it. Is that correct? And of course, before answering the questions that were being posed to you, you took a note. Now, previously you were shown a third document, a third statement, uh, dated December 19, 2010, by DC Cam, and I'm referring to Your Honor's e. 190.1.406 and that's what I want to briefly talk about. Do you recall giving that interview, sir? ແລະຈັ່ງມັນໂດລະອາກິສາສະໄວຮໍກະກາປັດນັ້ນຕ້ອງນັ້ນຍັງມີຍັງມີອັດອັດແນ່ອັດອັດມີປະຈັ່ງ
on Toad. So, if I understand you correctly, <coughs> and, uh, you're telling the trial chamber <coughs> that <coughs> you were never <coughs> interviewed <coughs> by a long Danny back <coughs> in December 19, <coughs> 2010. <coughs> An interview that took place in Dong Village, <coughs> Malai <coughs> Commune, Malai District, <coughs> Bantu <coughs> Province. That is <coughs> your testimony <coughs> under oath. Uh, Your testimony That was in my question. Did you give an interview to Long Denny from the Documentation Center of Cambodia? It's a yes, it's a no, it's I don't remember. Which of the three? ແລະໄມ່ຍັງບານປະຈັກມາດອງໃຫ້ຖ້າແນ່ຈົມປົດແນ່ສະໄວງລໍກາປັດນີ້ຍັງໄດ້ຊິອັດບານຈົມພຽ
on this particular page that I've shown you, where you say that Pol Pot assigned you to go with Ng Sri to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Do you see that, sir? Now, is it your testimony here today under oath that you never made this statement to the person who was interviewing you? That is, that it was Pol Pot that assigned you to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. ยังมีทางการตั้งท่าสบายรอการเปิดนั่งเยอะเวลาได้บ้านจุกเนี่ยซะอย่าไปใจมาอย่างจังไปเจ้าพรมสมังเกตอันนั้นเขียมตัวต
จียกับนอตเฮดเลเลอโซเฮอไอโลกพัดดัดเมดายในเลอไอจะซากรุบตมปัวโดยในโลกบานเถื่อนในจุบหมกเนี่ยสืบเกตในสกายไลท์ถ้าจะกรอมสืบเกตปีดองในโลกบานชลายมณีตีถ้าโลกบานเถื่อนในชนะปีปอนเปิลปีปอนใบบัญหาไอกสารนี้จำนองเจียสมพิหากิทอดสมเลงลูกสมนุสัวธาตากระลองมกเนขนองอัมลองปีลไข่ดับไฮจะไข่ดับชนะปีปอนดับเมื่อตาโลกเมียนบานเพื่อการสันตินีจูบสันตินีจะมุ่ยเนี่ยนะเตะได้เมียนกาเปียปอนดับดับบงมันมันนี้คือโลกบานอีเย่ดอลท้าโมรณะพิบระบอโลกตะมกได้นอมเอาเมียนกาสันตินีได้ลูกบานกระทำเมียนกาสันตินีจะมวยหนึ่งบกกลนามวยจังไอกษาดิเรียบถือเข้าปีไอกษาได้เรียบจำเลือกมุ่นนี่จะปัญหามวยดำไปเอาลูกดมเลิกกาจงจ้ำถ้าลูกลูกเมียนกาสันตินีได้จะมวยบกกลนาเด้ออมปีปัญหาเปียป้อนตัวหนึ่งระบบการปฏิบัติปฏิบัติทับตายนี่นี่จะปัญหามวยปัญหาที่ปีสมนูได้ลูกมีตัววิสุคือขนมในท้าเราสั้นบาลูกมันจะมาจำในขนมคลำซาในไอ้กระซาได้บานดักจะพูดหมกในลูกในกระด้อยท่านบาลูกกึศท้าเปลี่ยนแผ่นกาไอ้กาล้างได้ลูกจองจำไอ้ตอบแต่หนังสมนัวได้สู้คือลูกไอ้ชลายตอบหนังสมนัวได้สู้หนุบ้านไปโปรกรอนไอ้กระซาในกรอนที่มูลท้าดักไอ้ผีกี้สู้ในดาวลูกไปพูดเอาอย่างแรกบานสำหรับจะตัวด้วยให้ได้สายกษัตริย์นี่เนื้อขนมสนมเรื่องให้เพื่อกี้บรรทนาสมดั้งในจุดพวกมกอังจุนุยมเรียลูกยุลเตลูกรอยจิมตันบาทยิมยุลอาทัดิบายเดบอลูกปฏิเห็นบาทสมเชลุนมาทำปีนี้ Yes, just briefly, Mr. President. There may be a discrepancy in the dates between the English and the Khmer too. I'm told that the date and the Khmer version may be October. The date indicated in the English version is December. So perhaps that's something as well that should be clarified with with the witness. Uh, that's my understanding. So I, I was just passed a note saying that it was 19 October. The date of the interview would have been 19 October 2010. Does that help you? Does that help refresh your recollection? ให้มลกาจองจำบานได้เอาจะเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอาเอ And if we look on the very first page, which is Khmer 0066082020, the very first page of this interview, French 0075424, and English 0060621, it says that you acknowledge being the deputy provincial governor from 1997. Until 2005. Is that correct? Did you hold that position in that area? Yes, I was the provincial governor. Now that we clarified that, is it not a fact that you said? 
that Pol Pot assigned you to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Had moved the local branch like that. Pol Pot ban chặt tang ở lúc thực vòng pin càng nghe nấu của Sung Ka Bọt Tê. Mà chúng biết nên nhầm ai cái phía bao tam. Okay, does that mean that you agree that it was Pol Pot that assigned you to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs? Pol Pot ban chặt tăng ở lúc tuần qua nó có xuống cao bò tê ta lực ở chỗ sọt thành chẳng bền tê. Thank you. Now you do know a so hong, do you not? Ta lúc sọt so hong đại được gọn. And as I understand it, you have been following these proceedings, have you not? You were not here uh, in the gallery when opening statements were given by the prosecution? This would have, and this would have been, I believe, Monday, uh, November 21, 2011. Were you not in the gallery, sir? Were you not in the gallery, sir? And have you observed by any chance or had a chance to speak with So Hong concerning his public testimony? When you say yes, you mean yes, you did speak to So Hong about So Hong's testimony here in court, that is, the questions that were posed to him and the answers that he provided. Have you completed your... Have you completed your answer, sir? Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Now, uh, would it surprise you uh, to, if I were to tell you that when Song Hong was here testifying, he had indicated that when you were working at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, when it came to, the sec to security matters, you were under the supervision of Pong. แต่จำนึกนี้คือถ้าเนี่ยอยากให้ตายคือถ้าคิมเนาะน้องกระทรวงการบอลเตะนั้นกรอมอมยังสรี
Alright. Well, let me just read what he says after a lengthy passage of some questions, and this will be found on Khmer 0080-4560, English 0080-6504. And in French, it's 00806388289. This is from the testimony on the 30th of April 2012. I'm reading it's page 17 in English. And it's approximately at line 18. The question starts a little bit further up, but then I get to the thrust of my question, which is, and now my question is, while Comrade Chiam was at the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, although, and although he was your subordinate, was his superior still Pong, at least when it came to security matters? Answer, Pong was still the superior. This was So Hong's testimony under oath. Would you like to comment on that? Is he mistaken or is he lying? He was still Pong. He was still Pong. All right. Now, you were, however, under So Hong's supervision, were you not? He was your immediate superior. Now we're going to get to that perhaps tomorrow in great detail. But uh, for now, let me ask you this question. In the statements that you have provided before, uh, under, not a single statement have you indicated that you ever worked for the security apparatus within the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Is that a correct statement? And if So Hong were to say that, in fact, you did, and if others were to say from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs that you did, would, would they be mistaken? Or is it perhaps you are being, uh, are you are providing us with false testimony? Which of the two? ហើយអភិវឌ្ឍនឹងមួយណាលោកសូហងផ្ដល់ក៏ចំឡាយគឺមិនត្រឹមត្រូវក៏ហោះឬក៏លោកផ្ដល់ចំឡាយមិនត្
to ask him the factual matter, but he should not be asking, uh, putting questions to the witness that ask him to comment on whether other witnesses were uh, telling the truth or not. Mr. President, if I may briefly respond, those other people are either mistaken or lying. That's one possibility. Or the other possibility is this gentleman is lying when he says he was not part of security. That's the universe of choices. So, and that's what I'm trying to get this gentleman. I'm trying to pin him down under oath. ដោយឆ្នេះសេចក្តីចំទាស់មានប្រសិទ្ធភាពសាក្សីមិនបាច់ឆ្លើយតបទៅនឹងសំណួរដែលសួរដោយមេធាវីការពារក្តីលោកន
I just want to be very, very clear that that is your position. All right. We'll get back to that at some point. Uh, but let me, let me ask you, uh, now that you've acknowledged being appointed to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs by Pol Pot, uh, it would appear from your statement, your first statement, that you also had a special relationship with Pol Pot when it came to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. Would that be correct? บ่กดหาวเฮียมติดจูกอดนําเต้าเต้าจังเกียมูลฐานคือตามนายจมวยอมอิงสรีจมวยบองสอหองเด้จมูลจีเกียจันทร์ไตรจูกอดมาดองม
If I may respond, Your Honor, there's nothing in the statement here, either in this version or the one that was transcribed that mentions anything about Pol Pot being within Syria and then being together. I'm using exact, the exact words of this witness, and I'm asking the witness to give me a concrete answer. How was it that Pol Pot called him? Did he use a, a, a landline? Did he send a message? Because yesterday, the gentleman under oath said that it was Ying Shri that appointed him. Today, under oath, he acknowledged that it was Pol Pot. And this is why I'm asking this question. He acknowledged they having a special relationship. So I'm entitled to know how was it that Pol Pot called him. ហៅគាត់នឹងហៅដោយរបៀបណាតាមរយៈអ្វីបាទសាក់ថ្មីមកឆ្លើយតបទេព្រោះតំណូរនេះពិតជាទំនួរច្រំដែនសំនួរច្
ហើយអ្នកនឹងអាចជួយអ្នកនឹងអាចជួយអ្នកនឹងអាចជួយអ្នកនឹង And in fact, uh, you were asked yesterday about Deutsch's comment and that you had indicated that you never knew of S21. Whatever he wants to say, that's his affairs. That's what you are saying, and this is, can be found on your second statement. E3 now, are we to understand that you never ever met with Doyle? All right. So when he says, so, so I take it you are uh, asserting that Doik is not being accurate or truthful when he claims that he saw it. Okay. Now, if he claims that he saw it, ដំណើរថាប្រញ្ញាតែនឹងការតាំងតំណួរប្រជុំក្រោយដោយមិត្តវីជាមុនទិនសូមជួយដំណើរថាប្រញ្ញា I'll rephrase, uh, Mr. President. If we look at E3 slash 60, the Khmer 00195598, English 00195606, French 00195616. And this is from a written mm -hmm. record mm -hmm. of an interview uh, of Doik. Uh, Doik. This is the 3rd of June, 2008. And here it says, as for the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, there was a messenger who brought the prisoners to S21 named Chiem, who was roughly my age. So this is the part that you, you dispute. You're claiming that Doik is either mistaken or providing false testimony. Is that your position, sir? ជាតិខ្ញុំបានបញ្ជាក់ថាខ្ញុំមិនបានជួបដូចនឹងផ្ទាល់ទេបើណែអំយើងសេរីគាត់ជាគាត់ដូចដឹងហើយ <coughs> ទៅខាងក្រុមបំបីរចិត្តហើយបំបីរចិត្តគេយកតណាទេខ្ញុំអត់ដឹងទេថាខ្ញុំបានឆ្លើយអញ្ចឹងសិល <coughs>
All right, but here, Doik is saying, sir, that you, Chiem, a messenger for the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, brought the prisoners to S21, not to 870, not to some house, not to some hotel, but to S21. This is what Doik is saying. So is Doik providing false information to the investigative judges when he's saying this. ចាំផ្លាប់អង្គនិយាយសម្រេចលើកដែលយំទាស់របស់ដំណាងថាព្រៃញ៉ាជាមុនទិន the witness whether, whether that is correct or incorrect. I think it's inappropriate for him uh, to comment on uh, the state of mind of Doik in terms of whether he was lying, uh, whether he was mistaken, or the nature of the information. He should simply ask the witness whether that is correct or incorrect and not ask him to comment on Doik's uh, testimony. Well, you may recall, Your Honor, that Doik, first of all, was under oath when he gave the statement. Second of all, when he was confronted here in court, he stood by under oath to the statements that he made. So either Doik was mistaken or he was providing false testimony under oath. Or the gentleman there perhaps is not being truthful today. These are the possibilities. And I'm entitled to press the gentleman. សិក្ដីចំតោះរបស់ដំណាងថាពីញ៉ានិងមូលហេតុនេះដែលចំតោះធ្វើឡើងមានមូលដ្ឋានត្រឹមត្រូវសំស្របដែលចំតោះមានប
Nó tầm bó tì tì Come here Zero 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 two two eight five Pì Pì Pram bay pram Mẹ tử bí phá át tí chân Nhằm tạp Mà tệ chú bò là bò Nằm nào thay bình nhà chân bần thân Nó xong chơi nhỉ It sounds to me, Mr. President, as if Kim Yul-Kha is about to attempt to introduce the content of a confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as part of the confession. The defense has spent a lot of time objecting to the use of the SPD as Khlam Sa rưu prao phnei na ta khot miên mùl thaan chú bạp vây gom trò tê Well it seems that the prosecution wants to have it both ways When it suits them, they use confessions When it suits us, especially to contradict a witness, we cannot The information that I'm about to put into evidence is not about somebody being a CIA agent or KGB or someone being tortured It has to do with this witness, this confession saying that that person brought them to S21 That's what this is all about And it completely contradicts what the gentleman indicates and supports what Blake is saying and I think this is proper. And we should have a fast, a hard rule. Either nothing from confessions. And at one point, may I remind the trial chamber that even Judge Laverne corrected us and showed us as to the date when when Pong ended up at S21. So confessions have been used. So either we don't use them at all, and that goes to all parties. And the bench, or we have some sort of a rule that makes sense and is fair to both sides. So I'm entitled to put this to the witness and to get an answer. Did he take this person to S21? 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 Well, uh, Mr. Carnivus's characterization of the, of the use of confessions that we've made is entirely uh, inaccurate. Uh, we have used confessions for annotations that were not by uh, the detainee. Uh, we've used the confessions under the uh, exception allowed by the convention, which is to show uh, that a person was, at, uh, was in fact uh, at S21 on a certain date. Uh, but we have not attempted to use the content of the confessions, that is, the statements made by the uh, person being interrogated. Uh, so I think that this is entirely appropriate, his, his argument. Argument that it's either all or nothing ignores the legitimate uses of confessions. So I would disagree with this position. I think his attempt to read that before the chamber in his statement here is is entirely outside the rules of this court. Confession is rather clear that on 12-27-78, the person providing this confession is noting how that person got to S21, and that's why we believe it's pertinent and it contradicts this gentleman's testimony that he's given.
បាទអញ្ចឹងរះប្រគល់ភារជូនទៅលោកចក្រមតងម៉ាក់ដើម្បីសួរបញ្ជាក់ទៅនឹងមេតវីដើម្បីឃើកកម្មវិធីហើយន
to answer Judge Laverne's uh, question, we try to get it right. We're not trying to make any false accusations here. Uh, this is on E1 slash 7.1. I have the English version. It's ER number 0080 The date is 30th of April 2012. And it says here, Judge Laverne, line 15. Thank you, Mr. President. I'm sorry for interrupting the flow of the questioning from Councilor Karnavas, but I would like to draw the party's attention to the fact that on the 24th of April last, the prosecution put before the chamber a document, IS 5.14. This document is submitted as being Pong's statement, confession rather, and as regards to the dates that are mentioned, it appears that the first date on which Pong's confession was reported is the 28th of May uh, 1978, and the last date that is available on the document of which we do, uh, we do have the French and English translations is the 22nd of July, 1978. I think this is important because several times the witness said that Pong's arrest might have taken place in the days before the arrival of the Vietnamese in Phnom Penh, in other words, the end of 1978. So I do believe that there, there is a contradiction and we do have some evidence that we can draw upon in elucidating this. Thank you. So that was, uh, and I apologize if, if I got it wrong, but this is what I have, uh, Judge Laverne, and uh, I mean no disrespect by making reference to this. No, mais je pense qu'on peut éventuellement tomber d'accord sur le fait qu'il s'agisse d'annotations indiquant les dates des confessions. Mais est-ce que pour autant, vous considérez que ces annotations concernent le contenu des annotations Il me semble qu'il y a une différence entre une annotation qui précise la date à laquelle un interrogatoire éventuellement sur la torture a été commis, et le contenu de ces interrogatoires. I think we're in total agreement on that. I, I don't disagree. And, uh, I was merely reading what's in the record and from the record. Uh, uh, I was using that as a basis for, for answering the, uh, the response. Now, it's up to you to rule. Est-ce que, est que vous voyez une nuance entre le fait de dire qu'un juge se réfère au contenu et Well, there is a difference, but from, from what I'm reading here, perhaps I should have gone and checked to see exactly what was being referenced, but there's nothing in the text here that notes that it was a, uh, that this was in, in, in relation to an annotation, so obviously it's, it is my error to have assumed that you are actually looking into the document itself, but I'm reading what it says here, that you're pointing out a particular date, and it seems that we are using Confessions, whether it's, if we can only use annotations, then we should have a rule that only annotations provided by others than those who are providing the confession uh, can be admitted. I understand the nuance.
បាទហើយលនីដើម្បីអស្ត្រាយបញ្ហានិយាយបានច្បាស់លោះពីព្រោះយើងនៅចង់ចាំទាំងអស់គ្នាហើយអង្គចម្រះប្រកាន់ខ្ជាប់ជួនហើយប្រកាន់ចំហោដាច់ខាតគឺក្នុងការប្រើប្រាស់អនុវត្តបានជានិច្ចនៅអនុសញ្